What is up, guys? It is Nick. We are back on Black Desert. Um, gonna be on the Ranger today. Uh, just gonna talk about a couple of things and go over some stuff. I'm still trying to plan out how time and all of that'll go. Uh, if you want, you can check out my. Um, you can check out my Code Vein playthrough. Um, I'm having a lot of fun playing that right now, but. As for Black Desert, I'm trying still to figure out how much time I have and all of that different stuff. Obviously, I need to keep one character current with Xbox. So I need to figure out how, you know, how much time I'm going to need to sink into my Xbox character in order to, you know, have, you know, be progressed enough that I can, you know, make videos on the Xbox stuff. Because that's where I want my main character to be. It's my sorceress. I've invested a lot of time and money into that, so I am not switching off of that being my main character. Um, we do have new characters for S Xbox coming out next Wednesday. Um, I know for sure Tamer is. I haven't really looked into it. I'll just go over it when it gets here. We will have videos going over those. Um, I'm not sure if I will take both of them to level 56. I will take one of them to 56 on Xbox, but we'll have to see which one it's going to end up being. Because I don't know if I'm going to have enough time to do, like, both of them to 56. But I think I have enough time to do, like, one of them to 56. So, if it's just the Tamer, that works out really well. Because, like, Archer and Ninja, those worked out really well. Because they were the only, they were the only um, characters released at the time. And it made it kind of, like, reasonable to play them to 56. When they release two, especially now with school, which is ruining a lot of fun, um, it's it's leaning towards more of like a, one is going to be a challenge to begin with. I'm mainly now just trying to grind money on my Sork over levels. I do need to get to, I think I need to get to 60. 60, I think if I got to 60, I would be happy and then levels would be second to gear. I mean, I still think levels are second to gear to begin with right now, but we're still in that weird area where I where I need both. I, I, I don't think I'm like super under leveled. I think I'm under geared is my big problem. And I have it all planned out, but we don't have a whole lot of money. I'm going to do my best every Saturday night to be on for my guild guild boss scrolls because if i can be on for that i can definitely um i can definitely get a decent chunk of money especially if i get a laverto weapon i did get one laverto weapon bundle tonight so obviously it is okay i guess i can't get past it i guess it's it's saturday night obviously if i if my guild does the guild boss scrolls every saturday night but I went ahead and did get a Laverto. I got a bunch of Grunel and a bunch of pretty decent stuff. I think I got stuff equaling like 30 million for like an hour and a half of time, which is a decent amount for me. And so I'm very, I was very happy with that. And so I'm going to be doing, trying to do that every Saturday. The main issue that I am running into right now is that I need about 600 million. I have like three. 40 or something like that. I need like 650 to get the thing that I want, which is the um, uh, the, the bags gloves. Those are like the main thing that I need right now, try bags. And then once I get try bags, the upgrades that I'm looking at really aren't as expensive as that is. Um, I, I would probably either go for... See, I have 340, but the, the gloves I have sell for like 80 million, so I'm really closer than that. I'm only like 200 and something million away, but at the rate that I'm making money on the game, it's a little bit slower than I would want, I guess is what I'm trying to say. So, yeah, it's a little bit not exactly how I would how I'd like it. Why is the settings on the side of my screen? I think someone asked me how to hide these, and I thought they were just gone for me. I don't know why they're on for me now. Interface settings. How, where is this? I don't actually know how to turn it off. I thought it was just off for me. Or did I just never notice it was down there? I don't know. I, I swear that was never there for me, but I'm getting off. I'm getting off topic here. 
getting off topic. So my point is, is that I still am not quite sure. I feel like it's going to take a little bit of time still to figure out exactly what the heck I am doing. Um, I want to get this character to 56 and at least be able to awaken it. It's really hard for me to envision me having enough time to have two characters and have them both progress to like level 60 and have them fully geared and set to go it just takes a lot of time i guess i could do afk fishing and stuff i don't even do afk fishing on my xbox because i don't like leaving um my electronics on overnight in my room it makes my room like five million my room is already hot like a lot of the time when i'm recording videos you'll see me like scratch my face and whatnot it's because my room gets really hot and when i get hot i get like i don't know i my face gets kind of itchy because it's like sweating so but my room gets really hot i have a lot of electronics in here i mean i have three one of these days i'll do a, a, a setup video again or for the for i'll do a setup video maybe i'll do the setup video with the 10k subscriber q a that i want to do but the point is is that i'm going to well the point is, is that my room gets hot because I have a bunch of electronics. I mean, I have my PVR and my two mix amps. Those don't really give off heat, but the PVR does. It can get a little warm. I have three monitors all on when I'm doing stuff because one's a dual monitor setup and one's obviously I'm playing the game on. So I could turn one of the monitors off, but I kind of need it on. Um, a lot of the time, one of my TVs to the, I mean, it's to my right, but I think it's to your guys' left on the screen. Usually one of those has a sports game on just because I love sports. So it, it usually has some sort of sports on. Um, and then obviously one of my consoles is on, which that's generating heat. And then my PC itself is generating heat. And I always have lights on because otherwise my face is really dark. It's still pretty dark, but I usually have a light on behind there and over there. And so that always... This is kind of non-related to the video, but this is just something I'm going to talk about. Um, but yeah, that it, it makes the room hot. Or I have like this overhead light next to my closet that I turn on. It actually provides some decent light. Um, and so a lot of the time that'll be on. But it creates a lot of heat. So whenever you see me like itching my face like this or whatnot, it's probably because I'm hot. My room is like and there's like a distinct it's weird i have a fan in here and the yeti doesn't pick it up which i like the yeti used to pick it up and it would piss me off because i'm like oh my gosh i can't have my fan on so it was just five million degrees in here right now it's actually not bad um it's actually decently cool it feels nice in here right now um probably by the time i finish this video it usually takes like me recording a video to notice it's hot in here um not entirely sure why, but that's just kind of how it, it, it is. It's just how it works for me. Um, it just gets hot in here. But enough of that talk. The point is, and the point that I wanted to make this video was, is I'm still working hard to figure out exactly what I want to do and what content I want to bring. I think maybe every other Saturday, I kind of figure out how to do that video the best. I was thinking maybe every other Saturday I could do the Guild Boss Scroll video because it would give you guys something to watch. I mean, it's it, it's not the most interesting thing, but it's it's something. I can probably spice it up, make it a little bit more interesting. Um, it's it's just a lot of spamming attacks onto the the guild bosses. Maybe I'll do it once a month because it, it is it is not the most exciting thing. I don't even actually enjoy it. If I couldn't sit here and like watch YouTube or Netflix or live streams while I did it, I would go absolutely insane. But I can, so that, that helps out. But yeah, I'm still... The, the point of the video really is is just to talk to you guys, let you know that I'm still working on coming up with a strategy to best deal with making videos, honestly. It's kind of... What, I don't know. I don't have anything... I don't have anything better to say than I'm just working on it. I'm working on it, trying to figure it out. And it really is going to get worse next semester because my semester next semester is worse. It's harder. So I don't think it's going to get any better. So I need to like plan for future. So you guys, you know, have a general idea. I think doing like a let's play of a game, you know, I think Code Vein, you know, it's like an anime RPG uh, kind of centered around Dark Souls, but it's, you know, it's got, it's action combat. 
I think it's like nice to mix that stuff in because there's not always stuff in Black Desert I can cover unless you want me to just have a 30 minute video of me doing this essentially just progressing a character talking to you guys um, just kind of hanging out which might have to be the case with Tamer I mean obviously I'll cut stuff out and we'll do bosses and stuff like that and have fun with that I might do one of the characters in the future. So one of the characters that comes out new, um, I want to just do a boss rush on it, which I think would be fun for everybody. All we're gonna do is the, the, every episode will just be bosses. How many bo how many bosses can we get done in each video? If I can get done like ten bosses, then we get ten bosses done. If I get one boss done, we get one boss done. But each video will be like a boss rush, and I think that would be kind of fun. It'd be a little bit different. Um, and then there's one where I just am trying to figure out creative ways because I think the best content and the most enjoyable content that I get out of this game is just progressing characters. I really enjoy progressing characters to like 55. Because the 55 to 56 is a grind. I mean, it's something, it's a decently easy grind. It's like two hours farm, um, it's two hours farm, whatchamacallit, abandoned iron mine, and there you go. You're, you're that. Double XP, two hours, abandon Iron Mine, and you will be level 56, 56, 56. 56 to 57 is painful. Like, I don't want to do that again. And 57, 58 is awful. I don't want to do that again. So it's like, you know, you get my Sorceress being level 58 and onward. We'll be onward eventually here. We'll, we'll get Cook into 59. I'm going to make the push. I think... I think next week I should have a quiet weekend, um, and so uh, this weekend was really a quiet weekend, so I can't really be like, well, yeah, next weekend should be quiet. As long as nothing like crazy comes up, next weekend should be quiet, and so I think I should be able to, I, I want to sit down on a Saturday, I think next Saturday I'll sit down and just watch college football all day, which is really what I do anyway, uh, but <laughs> sit and watch college football and just grind out level 50. 59 and maybe a portion maybe like 10 percent to 60 if i could get that that's a lot to be honest because i'm like 22 percent on my sork that's a lot but if i could grind that out next weekend that would be great um i don't know i do a lot of my grinding solo so that's probably not the most conducive to leveling up quick either if we're being honest but it's just kind of the way kind of the way it is Kind of the way it is and kind of the way it has to be. Um, I play this... I don't have set times I play this game, which makes it really hard to have, like, set people that I grind, get on and grind with. Because some days, you know, I'm grinding... Like, right now, it's 12.30 in the morning or 12.30 a.m., however you want to... It's really midnight. It's midnight, okay? It's midnight. So that makes it kind of hard, you know? One night I'm on at midnight, then tomorrow I'm going to get on it probably 10 a.m. and grind a little bit. I don't know. I might make a Sork video tomorrow, just me going, hey, yeah, we're grinding here, doing my best to, to level up. Uh, so I'll probably maybe do a, gr a little bit of a gr half hour grinding video tomorrow. Won't go up tomorrow, but I will record it tomorrow because I because I want to stagger my Black Desert to make sure that it's not like, oh, here's six Black Desert videos in a row. And then here's no black desert videos for a week and a half so i want to stagger them and that's why i have the code vein so that we can have something on the channel uh for you guys to enjoy and it looks like you guys are enjoying it a decent amount i mean um obviously i don't expect it to um compete with my black desert videos but you know like i always say i just if someone finds enjoyment out of one of my videos that's all that matters to me if someone enjoys it uh, I'm not sure who's going to enjoy my massive blabbling in this video, but I felt like it was a video that needed to be made. I'm trying to progress the ranger here, so the ranger will probably get the most videos coming up because I want to get her to 56 because I want to awaken her, and then we can have fun with that awakening episode. I'm also waiting for her outfit to come on here because that'll be the only money I spend on PlayStation. Pro well, I'll probably spend for value packs because they're important because, like, I sold some stuff, so if we go... Central Market, you can see, like, I'm selling stuff. I'm not going to collect this stuff yet, but I'm, like, selling it. And I don't want to lose the 30%, so I'll probably spend the 15 bucks and get the value pack, which is kind of annoying. 
I might try to get like the one day value pack. Is there a one day value pack in like the loyalty or something like that? I might try to do that. I have a bunch of one days on Xbox, which I'm going to use wisely. Um, when I take like my breaks from Xbox, cause we all know that's going to happen again that I'll, I'll take my little break from Xbox, but yeah, I, I probably should stop blabbling on here. Um, there's not a whole lot more to, to, to go on about, but I just wanted to update you. I'll try to keep updating as we go. I'm still working through my schedule. We had the new hours at where I work, and so that's really messed stuff up. I don't know what my set schedule is. I talked to my boss or the lady who makes the schedule uh, about this because she was there's a girl that I usually work with that they were going to cut her hours completely out and just have me work. And I said, well, why don't we split the hours? Because I really don't care. I work enough hours to begin with. I, I don't need them to, like, make sure I have X amount of hours. So I, I'm willing to give up some. I, I don't need to work, like, 30 hours a week. So I, I want to cut back hours because I want to, you know, spend time. I want to have time to do everything I want to do. So point is, is that I told them to cut me back and work four instead of six hours on that day and then give her uh, four hours and then... We would overlap, but it wouldn't be overlapping them, like, double paying us. She would need to be there anyway. But my point is, is that that's what it does. I know she's like, an, I'm, you know, I'm a college student. I don't desperately need the money. She's a, no, she's sing. I don't know. She's a mom, so I know she, like, needs, she, she, she has, she's a mom with, like, three kids. So I know she needs a job. So I'm like, yeah, definitely don't cut her hours for me. Like, please just give her the hours. So I'm still kind of working through that and seeing, like, next week I only work four hours, which I was, I asked some days off, but I only worked four days next week because I had a couple of things that I have to do, uh, and I have to make a trip for college to, uh, like, three hours away to do something for an internship. So, yeah, I, I request the days off. I only work four hours next week, uh, and so I, I gotta see how it's gonna go because our schedules officially changed massively just recently and so i want to see how it goes so i will probably have a definitive set schedule coming very soon the goal i think is to upload two black desert videos a week right now i think that's my main goal is to upload two a week uh, maybe three but two i think is an obtainable goal two with like four to five code vein videos every week i think that's what we're that's what i'm striving for right now uh so yeah don't have much else to say. If you have any questions for me about the schedule or anything you want to ask me or tell me or anything like that, let me know, uh, and I will catch you all in uh, the next video when it's hopefully a little more exciting than me just rambling on. But, uh, yeah, a lot of my videos include me rambling about whatever and whenever and whoever. So, you know, so it's kind of what you got to deal with every once in a while with me. But, yep, I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Cause when it's all over